Ali, let me first start by congratulating you on a fantastic job. I know last night when we were in the cinemas, when we first saw your face on camera in the movie, the audience just erupted and everybody was so happy mm. and so proud. What was that moment like for you when you watched the movie for the first time and you saw yourself on screen? You know, when I saw it for the first time, it was on the 29th in LA, the premiere of LA. It, you know, when I saw it that time, okay, I really wanted to see myself, but my mind was all over because I was so mesmerized by everything that I was seeing there. And there was a lot of applause, a lot of, lot of noise. People were just so receptive about it. But yesterday, it was so different because now I'm seeing it for the first time and I'm able to even follow everything because when we shot, we were not given the whole script. We were just given your part. And for the first time, the person who appeared first, before we come to me, Atando. When Atando came in, the house just erupted. Then Brajon came, the house just erupted. Konichume came, the house erupted. And it was such a beautiful spiritual feeling, if I should put it that way, you know, to see how much my own people appreciate our work. And just by appearance, the first time I appeared, I didn't even say anything. It was just my face. And the applause just went crazy. And it really, you know, touched me inside. Wakanda. Forever. <laughs> yes, Wakanda forever. <laughs> A fictional place, but so beautiful. The scenery was amazing. Now, let's just pretend that Wakanda was real. Is there a part of Wakanda that you would spend a lot of time in? You know, I live in the city. I was brought up in a city. I was born in a city. I think if I was to go to, to Wakanda, I would really would have ex wanted to experience the, 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 the innovative inventions by Shuri, you know, just to be on those spacecraft and see Wakanda really well. And if I'm not there, then I would go to the to the rural side just to chill and 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 calm down. Now, for me, there were so many lines in this movie that stuck with me. You know, somebody would say something, and I'd be like, "Wow!" Was there any line in this movie that was so good that you you listened to it and you kind of wish that that line was written for you? No, you know, not necessarily written for me. But there's this line where Kilmonga was dying. You know, and he said, bury me between the Atlantic, in the Atlantic, between the two continents, so that I can feel the spirits of my people. That for me was was very, very powerful. That was actually the line I was referring to. Yeah. My favorite yes. line in the movie. 